Okay, well, nothing fancy here. Um, these two aluminum bars are what I'm going to use to make sure that this engine mount is adjusted this way. Okay. Um, I've had these for many years and what I did was I bought 6061 T6 aluminum bars. They're pretty thick. I bought two of them. One there and one there. And uh, I made sure they were machined perfectly parallel and flat and everything else. So, um, and I just use these for measuring for lots of things, lots of airplane projects or whatever you need. It's really nice to have a straight edge. So I just basically took jig blocks, screwed them down, made sure it was tight, and there's a line right here. You know, remember, this fuselage never left the table, so I have to be able to depend on that line that I drew that was originally 90 degrees to that center line. Okay, So that's the line of reference I used, and I just made sure it was plumb, straight up. And that way I can pull a tape from this edge all the way to here. This is just a piece of channel. You know, again, I just use tape. There's nothing wrong with that. Just make sure it's tight. Um, you can see the motor mount came out really, really uh, straight. All the edges of this are hitting. So I know that the motor mount itself is not humped. So that's really important to check. But I just pulled a measurement now on the left and right side. See, if you measure out... A far distance you can get it more accurate so um, and my preliminary measurement came out that I was maybe a 30 second off on the left side of the airplane so no big deal because this is just still cut straight this is just floating okay so I'm gonna start trimming it and making up that difference and you know see how straight I can get it